Welcome back to Let's Play Ratchet and Clank Up Your Arsenal. I'm Nye, and we are on Quark's Hideout, about to send Clank off to do some stuff. He truly is Secret Agent Clank. Dealing with not lawn gnomes and all that jazz, because you know those things are scary. Okay. Come here, you. Help me out. That's fine, they couldn't follow me through this gap anyways. I don't know why the, uh, platforming segments of Clank sections are so, um, simple, I guess is the word I'm looking for. Like, the lasers are extremely easily dodged. I mean, compare this to the, uh... Okay. Compare this to the section I just did with Ratchet in the previous episode, where I was going through all those weird, you know, circular lasers with the gravity boots and all that jazz, and then you see the lasers here, and you're sitting here going to yourself, uh, do you underestimate my intelligence, or my ability to play platformers? <coughs> Didn't I already have that gun? I still want to know how they manage the end space they have going on here. Okay. Because I need this money. Okay, furball. Get to it. And again, this time with feeling. Okay, I'm done with that. Go across the go across the bridge. Across the bridge, I say. Now the question is, if, Qu if Clank can speak monkey, why doesn't he just ask him, what's with all this banana business? Or is the monkey simply a jerk who wouldn't help unless we banana him? At least the monkey keeps them distracted, you know? Okay. I guess I'll do this one first. As I said, easy platforming segments. That doesn't even count as platforming, there were no platforms! It was just, go, walk up, go underneath lasers! do thing. Ow. Thank you, monkey. I appreciate that. That was the best possible place you could have ran at that particular place in time. <coughs> best place. Never there when you need them, always there when you don't. Hey, would you stop getting shot at? I need you now. On to the pad, monkey. Yep, 
we gotta do all of it all over again. This section would be less obnoxious if you didn't have to restart any time you died. Then again, easy platforming segment, so what do I know? So apparently that's how that's supposed to happen. Okay, monkey boy. Ow. Come on, let's go, Clinkbot. We've got a princess to say it. Wait, wrong mission. I get a bad feeling about this next section. The monkey isn't even in here, but somehow I imagine he's gonna get me killed. Press button and profit? Hi, nice long johns. Secret vid comic, Quark. Oh, that. Well, I expect you to understand. You'll probably look at me and think I'd give anything for a body like that. For just one drop of his raw animal magnetism. One iota of his impeccable. Can we just skip to the end, please? Oh, let's see, where was I? Sexy, charming, brilliant, iron hard abs. Ah, yes, but despite my outward appearance of utter perfection. Well, um, you're an poop. You're a cowardly wuss. No, not exactly. When I escaped from that star cruiser, cheating death by mere nanoseconds, I suddenly realized something very important. I could have died. Me, Captain Quark. Imagine an entire galaxy with no more me. And for what cause? So a few trillion people get turned into robots. Who am I to say who should or shouldn't be turned into a robot? You're pathetic, Quark. I can't believe I once looked up to you. Let's go, Clank. The people of this galaxy need you, Quark. They believe in you. You can give them hope. You have a chance to redeem yourself and become the hero you have always wanted to be. Or not. That's fine, too. It's fine. I can be a hero. Oh, also. Can I? Can I please? No. Damn. How about over here? No? Nope, I can't break anything in his room. Come on, anything? Really? Damn. Iron hard abs. Well, you know, there's that. So that was entertaining. What? Wanted to say what? He's lost. Engage the gravimetric warp drive. This one's kind of required. I don't actually get to stop this. Otherwise, I mean, I got stuff to do over on Annihilation Nation. So, this isn't exactly high up on my priorities. Da -de -da -de -da. Doo -doo -doo. Uh, 
That's not good, it's in red. Red is usually a bad sign. Oh, hey, people are getting shot. That's fine, there's a vendor here. It'll make everything better. No, I, no, 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 no longer interested. Let's, uh, pull these out. And, uh, start working on this. At this point, there's really no point in having multiple sets of them. Whoop! Up, soldier! Don't ride in front. You're just gonna get yourself killed. At this point, there's no real point in actually having multiple sets of uh, um, agents of doom out, unless one of your sets gets killed. Because the set on the ground is just gonna run out and blow up. It's best to have the bodyguards. Just gonna dodge that for a while. Any new armor for me? Nope. Okay, I guess I'll take this seriously. To some extent. <coughs> yep, I gotta walk. Ow! Mommy, he hit me. And the final upgrade. The liquid nitrogen gun. So this is the upgrade they changed. It's no longer the meteor gun, it's the liquid nitrogen gun. Uh, it's, from what I understand, it has a chance to freeze, and if it freezes and you keep on attacking them, it'll, it'll uh, shatter. Which is kind of cool. Of course, that's one less gun for me to work on. The ninjas are kind of worth a lot of experience. By the way, in case you were wondering, there are no skill points in here, there are no trophies in here, there are no bolts in here. There are just ninjas. Really, really bad ninjas. Let's see, where does this go? Right about there should do it. <coughs> More like a ninja, you know what I mean? Ah, crap. Yeah, you go that way. That's a good idea. Yay, Infectinator grows up. What does it do now? Let's see. Splash damage. Double EXP for the Infectinator, which... A gun that doesn't really like EXP in the first place? I can live with that. Okay, you know what? This one, I'm not gonna even... We're, we're not gonna even play with him. We're just gonna say... Nope. And I'm gonna die. That's, that's fine, too. Which sets me all the way back here. This is... Basically when the game starts ramping up the difficulty. Not necessarily... Like... In true difficulty-wise... But the whole, if you die, you go back a long ways. There are no saves, no continues. There are no ways for you to win. I'm going to need this infectinator later, which is why it's getting upgraded. <coughs> What's it do now? An increased rate of infection. Meaning the dot uh, progresses faster. I have no idea what that beeping means. Should I be concerned?
Should I, should I be taking this seriously? Oh, I guess if I must. I believe this is actually a take your time situation, but if I must hurry. Oh jeez. That was less than stellar on my part. Look, not interested in any of your crap. Let's see, what do I have? that. So that will solve all of my problems nicely. Okay. And you know, I say all my problems, but you know, doesn't solve the ones that matter. I think I actually have to kill this guy. Wow, he does a lot of damage. Taking it seriously, right. Okay, would you stop dodging my stuff? I mean, I know you're ninjas, but this is getting ridiculous. Hold on, I gotta take care of some ninjas real quick. So, do the uh, different, um... What do the different lightsabers mean? Does that mean that some of you ninjas are better than the other ones? on saying that. Does that actually mean something? Oh, wrong button. That was the button I intended to... Oh, come on! Really? Am I allowed to just ignore these guys like I always do? any of the guns I want to shoot. Okay. My completely broken go away all of you. I don't really actually like you in the first place guns. Apparently that guy's already dead. I don't like you. Any of you. Even and most especially you. Is that guy dead twice? Yep, he's dead twice. Okay. There's more. Of course there is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Infect a bomb, blah, 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 wuss, wuss, wuss. It's a pretty good weapon. Let's put it that way. Okay, I'm on the bridge. What's up? <laughs> you certainly took out speed time. Hey, it's good to see you too. Everyone okay? We're fine. We made it just in time. Any luck with the data disk? Huh. Lucky then. I'll crack at 
the encryption. Woo! The disc contains a complete copy of Nefarious's battle plan. Go nerd. He's going to attack planet after planet, leaving nothing but robots in his way. No, really? The obliterator is so well protected. Nefarious doesn't believe we can stop it. Can we? I estimate our odds at approximately 1 in 63 million. Give or take. Just enough. That's, uh... Well, you know, not so bad. A bio-obliterator is programmed to recharge its power cells after each attack. It's recharging at a base on planet Koros right now. And Ratchet, the next target is Veldin. Why do they always attack my planet? I mean, really? That's just rude. Well, guys, now it's personal. They're attacking Veldin. How the hell did they get this thing set up again so quick? I couldn't even ask. When I see you guys next time, we're going to be going to planet Koros. No, we won't. We'll be going to other places because I've missed a couple of things in the past. So I will see you guys at those other places. Ta-ta!